is Photoshop Background Remover, better than the online background removal tools. In this video we'll find out. Let's try the best method to remove complicated hair in Photoshop. First duplicate the layer. Add a solid fill adjustment layer and make it black. Pull this layer below the duplicate layer. Click to make the layer active. Then go to select and color range. Leave some of the settings as they are. We'll change these later. Using the first eyedropper, click anywhere in the background. Next click on the eyedropper with a plus sign, and then click additional areas of the background. Since the hair is pink, it's easy to get a good selection. Adjust the fuzziness to get as much of the hair as possible. Since we've selected the whiter areas of the background, some of the brighter areas of the skin have also been selected. Deselecting these areas is the next step in this process. With the active layer selected, click Mask. Next go to Select and click Select and Mask. Use the Select tool in Paint on the areas we want to keep. Use the onion skin mode to get a better distinction. Paint all the areas you want included in the final image. In some cases, Photoshop selects extra areas. Press Alt and click to unpaint these areas. Use the Refine Brush tool to get some of the hair back. Press Decontaminate and then OK. As you can see, this is a good selection, but let's see if this is better than some of the results produced by other AI background removal tools. The first background removal tool we'll try is Pixlr. Click on the Remove Background option and upload your image. The free version will remove some of the background, the premium feature will remove the rest of it. The next tool is Remove BG. Once again, upload your image and the tool will do its work. At the end of the video we'll place these transparent images against a black background and compare them. Adobe Express has a background removal tool and it works the same way as the previous tools. Next we have Removal.ai. This is a great tool for background removal. Finally we have Fodor. Once the background is removed, Fodor will give you options to change the background color.
Let's do some comparisons. Here is the Photoshop image we worked on. As you can see, no halos and the cutout is very clean. Removal.ai has done an excellent job in retaining the details. The highlights have been maintained on the hair and the individual hair strands are visible. Just to compare, take a look at the original image and take a look at Removal.ai, very precise and quite accurate. Remove.bg has also done an adequate job in background removal and maintain some detail, but there are halos around the strands of hair. Adobe Express has also done a great job in maintaining the details, but there are halos. Photor and Pixor performed the worst of the lot. To be fair, this is Pixlr free version and not the premium version. Although Photoshop does an excellent job in removing backgrounds, there are some great online tools to do the same and in a matter of seconds. If you're looking for a quick, pain-free and effective way to remove background from an image, then we recommend Removal AI. We hope you find this video useful. Please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.